So my partner and myself, we started getting to VR. And at that time, we have noticed that the equipment were all like this. And they are kind of bulky and then a little bit silly. So first of all, in order to put that helmet in and also all the cables in, you need a bigger box or a briefcase. And if you think about, like you want to use that in the train or in the plane while you're on business trip, it's almost impossible. On top of it, you need a very powerful computer, but that computer is going to cost you a lot of money, and you need to learn about it, uh, learn about it repeatedly, and you have to adjust it. Even the founder of Oculus, Palmer Lucky, he also said, that the cables are going to be the main obstacle for VR industry. And why? Because most people do not have a designated person to manage those cables. So on top of it, we have to say those VR devices, they are not light. And all these VR devices in the market, they are pretty heavy. They are, um, I would say, approximately over one pound. So if you wear their VR devices, then your face will become like this. And you know the mark on that. That was kind of ugly. And yes, I'm talking about this one. It is just like a pair of sunglasses. It is the real VR glasses. And I'm talking about Duo V1. In 2015, Mark Zuckerberg had ever said this. The VR devices in sunglasses style it's a must and it will be the future trend and it will take Facebook approximately five to ten years to realize this dream however today here we can be proudly to share with everybody we have made it so following that I'm going to walk you through more about this product V1 This is the V1. So first I would like to say Duodo V1. It is a real VR glasses. It is the combination of the state of art and also the technology. Don't believe it? Let me put it on for you guys. Secondly, let's talk about the weight. And then VR, V1, Dodo V1, this one, we use carbon fiber as its material. And it is really light. How light it is? It's only 3.1 ounce. And try to take out your iPhone 6 Plus from your pocket right now. That iPhone is going to weigh approximately 6.8 ounce. So try that right now. And our V1 is actually only half of the weight from the iPhone. So thirdly, let's talk about the thickness. For the Dodo V1, the average thickness is only approximately 6, a point zero, point zero, a point, correction, 0.63 inches and it is actually approximately the same to the diameter of the 1 cent US dollar, US. And then for the same type of product, that kind of a thickness basically would be 4 times thicker. So fourthly, let's talk about the size. The Dodo V1, basically the size is approximately 80% smaller than the ones in the market. And we can fold it, we can put it in a glasses box, we can put it in a purse, we can take, if you want to, we can put it in a pocket. Then go on a business trip, go to the bar, go to the coffee shop, anywhere. You enjoy this kind of immersive experience anytime and anywhere. And on top of it, fifthly, um, V1, Dodo V1, we basically have this kind of two different separate design. You can connect, use one piece of cable and you can connect it to all kinds of different main machine. It can get connected to the PC, it can get connected to your cell phone, and it can co get connected to the mobile devices that we have designed specifically for V1. This is called Dodo D1. So now let's take a look at the V1's performance. So first, I would like to talk about the Dodo V1. Those two pieces of glasses, so each one of them get to the resolution 1200 by 1200. So the total resolution has exceeded over 2K. And of course, the PPI is also over 800. 
Well, this is the only one that can get to this level. Let's take a look at this lady. Well, if the PPI is not there, what do you see about this lady is pretty burly. And then, wasn't that kind of depressing? <laughs> And then on top of it, we have developed this kind of, uh, um, we call it a predict algorithm. It's, it is used to calculate the head movement. So why do we do this? We do this to solve these kind of vertical issues that have been derived from this VR technology. So as a result, it improves this kind of experience dramatically. And on top of the V1, the field of view has already got to one point, one, 105 degree. And I would say this kind of level pretty much is very close to how we see things naturally. And then of course this is actually going to ensure our maximum immersive experience. So from the screen, the resolution, and then um, the predict algorithm and also to the FOV, we have owned more than 127 global patterns. And with this advanced technology, it is to ensure that the Dodo V1 is not just an art piece. Not only that, it of course has the best VR experience. So the size and the function of V1, it's pretty similar to iPod Touch. So the, this D1, basically, the, it has this uh, mobile operating system called Dodo OS. It is based on the customized uh, Android system. So it is equipped with 64-bit four-core processor and then also with a 3,000 amp high-capacity battery. And it definitely can support a continuous two to three hours of a continuous video play. And then on top of it, we have also developed another app store. It is called Dodo VR, and it contains 3D, uh, 3D movies and then panoramic those kind of videos and also gaming. Definitely, you can download that from our main website and other major shops. And definitely, it supports major VR devices. Of course, that includes our V1 devices, Dodo V1 to America. This is the place where the freedom and the dreams can be realized. And I would like to share our joy and our proud with everybody here. For the following three years, we are continuing on going to we are continuing on working on this and we are hoping to build a complete VR ecosystem, which means that we are going to develop our VR social social uh, social life and also maybe in the near future every one of us will have one or more virtual reality identities and we are going to live in this virtual reality world so isn't that fun next month we are going to initiate a 50 day long the fun of uh, crowdfunding um, on Kickstarter and then we will welcome everybody to play a role in that and then I also would like to invite everybody to become the first part of the um, V1 users to auto V1 devices in classes style. The sales price will be 559 US dollars. Lastly, thank you for coming to Dodo V1. Lastly. <laughs>